My name is Sophie Kay and uh, I'm a researcher in computational biology at the University of Oxford. Well, I'm working on an educational scheme which is called the Open Science Training Initiative. I uh, started this about a year ago, so it's um, you know quite an exciting time for the project. And the, the overall aim of as OSTI, as we're calling it, um, is to get into graduate level training and try and convert existing subject specific courses into an open science training course that's going to deliver, deliver the subject specific content as well as training in open science. Um, the thinking behind it is that students need to know a little bit of the sort of ethos and ideology behind open science, how to actually implement that, so all sorts of aspects of openness, whether that's adequate data management, data management plans, version control, licensing, um, open access publication. These are all different aspects that go to that sort of cohesive open science whole. And uh, we want them not just to know about how to implement those practices, but also to get them to integrate those approaches into their working habits day to day to hopefully deliver really well-rounded, open researchers in the sciences. All sorts of reasons. I mean, to be honest, uh, I was I was here at Mosfest last year as well, and uh, it's generally a fantastic hotbed of ideas. I think uh, it's really fortunate that it draws on people from all sorts of subject areas, um, all sorts of different sections of the community, whether that's researchers, um, sort of general interest people. Um, right through the spectrum and at all levels of academia as well. So I think it's a great way to um, sort of be privy to all sorts of interesting conversations and discussions, to sort of meet and exchange ideas with people that I already know and work with, but at the same time to draw on all sorts of other people that they might know. And uh, I think it's quite a sort of fertile ground for developing projects and meeting new and interesting people.